Hey, what's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Yeah, today I'm going to show you how you can make a cool, really growly bass just like Barely Alive. And it sounds like this. Wow, that sounds super growly. So, let's just get to the sound design. Okay, just grab an init preset, choose a note D sharp. And then, let's change the wavetable. I've seen a lot of Barely to Life tutorials and also Belly Life themselves made a tutorial and they're using a lot of monster wavetables to make the growls so we're gonna use one. Make it really cool. Put it down two octaves. Sounds are really growly. So now it's time for the LFO shape, that's really important. We're gonna choose the trigger mode, um, go on one half and move this thing over here. Then make another point here. And move it over there and make it a bit more smoother. Yeah, that's already perfect. So now let's automate the wavetable position a bit. So now let's automate the level with it. So the because I hear in the background a noise that's clashing. And now it's perfectly fading out. We're gonna choose a sour wave on the other oscillator, move it down, do the FM for B thing. This gives it a lot more crunch, and we're gonna put this down to octave as well. Then choose another filter, which is using the PP one, uh, PP. And we are moving the cutoff over there. And we'll bring the frequency up a bit. Oh uh, yeah, and don't forget to turn up the resonance, otherwise it would sound horrible. By doing that, we can bring out some frequencies to make the space sound even cooler. We get the valley effect noise. Just a bit, a tiny bit. Put it in the filter as well. A sub, choose a triangle, put it down too, and automate it. Yeah, and now we are already done with the oscillator parts. We need to add some effects, for example, a distortion. And I think to get the cool distortion on a bad life growl, we need some downsample distortion. And bring the drive up a bit, around 42, that's perfect. And turn the mix a bit down and modulate it backwards. So, right into the middle. This should be it. Oh yeah, we're getting there. And now let's choose a hyper dimension to make this sound wider, but not that much. Because it's still a growl, turn the size down, but turn the mix a bit up. So now that this stereo spectrum is way nicer. Turn the mix a bit down, then the LPF rate, the low pass filter, yep. Feed like that, the depth down. And yeah. That's also a cool, really cool and special trick. You can add just a chorus to make the bass is even fatter. That works mostly good. Now it's time for some delay. We're gonna link them together and put them down to 125. 1 to 256. Then ping pong delay, only the highs, and the mix is good. Now it's time to finish it off by a multi band compressor. Just turn the gain a bit up, we don't need that much. And we should be done. If you like the video, just give a, leave a like, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more cool tutorials, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!